What's going on, y'all? This is Loki. This is Key, our low key. So welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. Where we talk about elevation, self-growth, and above all else, creation. What have you created today? Yes. Have you got it in? Have you got it out? Mm -hmm. You know, or was you in it now? Did you think about your goals for a little bit and then you started entertaining yourself with bullshit? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what have you created? Create, 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 create. Then when you're done, you rest and you create some more. Absolutely. The creator creates. You know, he doesn't destroy. Everything that is destroyed is meant to be created again and better. Absolutely. What are we talking about, bro? So today we're going to talk about trusting yourself believing in you and how how things can come on a daily basis situations may rise on a daily basis and you may not even see things coming your way you just must trust yourself and it's hard to trust yourself when you're focused on one thing but then something else is happening on the back end then when you take care on the back end and something is happening on the front end and then you have a bunch of things that are going on it's kind of hard to to look within and i know it is because i've been there it's kind of hard to look within and trust your judgment trust your your decisions trust that you have the answers trust that you know what you're doing yeah you know so you must trust yourself Take a look, stop, quiet your mind, and think. You know, if God didn't allow you to go through the things that you that you've been through or what you're going through now, then you he would think you weren't quit, equipped enough to handle it. But he thinks that you are. You know that you are. You just gotta dig deep, focus, and trust yourself. Yeah. What you think? I think a lot of people stray away from that belief and trust in themselves so, because you're around too many people, like, and you're not resisting. They will. So you constantly doing what everybody else doing, you know? And I think over the years, like, just coming up, a lot of people don't need, they lose trust in themselves. So, yeah. You know, until you realize that most of the time you have to separate to elevate mm -hmm. first mentally mm -hmm. you know in the form of studying and researching if you're not able to separate physically mm -hmm. and then a lot of times in order to you know begin to do the healing and understand and trust yourself and trust that you put here and your will is just as powerful as the next it's necessary for you to separate physically Boom. spend that time in solitude learn yourself you know mm -hmm. understand what you need to work in but more importantly understand like what you excel in over others mm -hmm. and then dig in on that and that thing you could use that thing in any field that you're trying to do to get better at. But you have mm -hmm. to trust yourself. Mm -hmm. You have to trust yourself to do all of these extraordinary things mm -hmm. that take a lot of work, patience, and consistency. Mm -hmm. You have to trust yourself to go out on a limb when everybody else in this turning lane, nobody in that turning lane, you have to trust yourself to go in the turning lane with nobody going. Absolutely. You about Absolutely. to say something? No, I agree. Mm -hmm. Because the, I want to say this physical world that we live in, so what you see every day, your circumstance, your situation, that's not what's real. When you understand that and in your mind, you know what you want. And you know where you're going. And you know what it takes to get there. That's what, that's what's real. Yeah. I had to train myself to think that way because and even sometimes, you know, I'm not perfect. I fall 
back into the mindset of like, okay, this is becoming really real. But then it's like, no. And I talk and I, I tell myself, no, this is not real. What's real is the end result. What's real is the goal. What's real is everything that I want. And I'm going to have it because I get what I want because I know that it's mine. That's it. And I believe in myself enough to go get it. So if God lives in you and he made you, he created you. If he created you, you were meant to create. You were meant yeah, to make something. That's simple but deep. Yeah. For sure. So you got work to do. That's like a duck. You know what I'm saying? Having a duck and the duck don't quack. <laughs> you, know, you gotta understand. Like it's simple, mm -hmm. but it's real. Mm -hmm. I ain't even thought of that till you just said that for real. Yeah. The creator created you, so that means you able to create. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Just the fact that a woman can procreate, mm -hmm. like it's right there in the word. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You got something else, baby? No, that's it. So just believe in yourself. Trust yourself. Trust, Trust in your abilities and your wildest thoughts and imagination. Go for it. Create. I'm low. I'm key. This is key. And this is low key. Low key. Low key, baby. Don't forget about me. No, baby. Like, comment. <laughs> and subscribe. Peace.